Hello and welcome to the September 2014 issue of Spiritual Headlines. It's the end of September. It's been a long campaign, a very successful campaign that we can all take pride in for God's glory. Not personal pride, but just that we ran the race, we crossed the finish line, we can hold our head up high, those of you who helped contribute and put this together. And now we're going to go on to the next race. Uh, the thing is to finish, cross the finish line, and then just feel that excellent uh, momentum. Um, many of you, many of you helped contribute uh, chickens with the express purpose of helping people less fortunate pull themselves out of a lower income bracket or poverty bracket to transform their communities and create a perpetual wellspring where the chickens will multiply. They multiply very fast like rabbits and they'll be able to give eggs out immediately in the communities and they'll also be able to, in time, it takes about four months, duplicate the exact same project to and start another chicken farm or multiple farms of their own. So just an absolute slam dunk, grand slam, I'm going to use sports analogies. Uh, I want to thank each and every one of you. Those of you who haven't, you'll find the link to chickenblessing.com below. And it's PayPal. It's the most secure way to send uh, assistance to someone from around the world. There are two projects that we were running current at the same time. One is for Africa. One is for Guatemala. So now that I finished Africa, I'm moving on to Guatemala. Uh, all you can do it from your phone, your tablet. Let's say you had a very good month. You're working sales. You say, you know, what? I want to buy a chicken. I want to buy a chicken for that community. You can do it right from there. Boom, and the money will be sent uh, from the parent church of this church onto the recipient, the the person the administrator in charge of purchasing the chickens at the local farmers markets, adult chickens, and beginning the process of, of having a chicken farm. It's just a tremendous blessing. It's an example of a new wine skin versus an old wine skin. This is a new paradigm church. At first maybe the, the people there don't quite see it. They see it only as a business. But in all actuality you're dealing with the, the people in the farmers market. You have people coming in for eggs, you have people coming in for chickens. And you can talk about the good news of the gospel to them without it being where it's a pastor preaching to a bunch of pews. It's an entirely new perspective. I just want to thank each and every one of you for participating. There's a lot of other areas that we're covering this month, but of course this is the big one. So congratulations. God bless you. We'll see you in October. Much love.